I'm Cher Martinetti, and we're here with Christy Marston inside of the Wonder Woman Family Museum, which is, by the way, like the sickest thing I've ever seen in my life, and I want to pretty much move in. But let's start with some of these dolls that you have. Um, this is the first Wonder Woman doll. Yes. This is not her shield. <laughs> no, they just gave it to her because they felt like it. So this is from the 70s. Like we have the Linda Carter Wonder Woman doll. Yeah, and that's and actually, that's what happened is when the TV show came out, that's when everything hit. You know, there was a reason to have toys out there suddenly because so many kids were watching that show. So that's when you saw that, like, everything just, like, waved out immediately. And during that time period, there was a lot of it. How many items would you say you have in here? Something just over 4,000. And just in this room right now? Uh, this room and the library upstairs w with books. I'm just thinking of total, total. Somewhere in that range. But I'll show you something that's the most fun. Show me. Okay. We're going action figures, action figures. Here we go. Bootleg. Now, bootleg is its own special category, okay. but this is the best bootleg piece. It's Wonderful Woman Wobbler, you know, like the hula dancers yeah. by the cars? All right, look at the back of the package. Is that Elvis? Yeah, they glued a piece of rug on some poor dude's face to make him <gasps> Elvis and enhance your drive time. My fav absolute favorite bootleg. That's amazing. And there's no shortage of bootlegs. Stationary bags, edibles, placemats. I love these placemats. Oh, and there's a pinball machine. So another thing that's jumping out to me, the one with the underoos. <laughs> that I definitely used to wear these when I was little, and I used to run around thinking I was Wonder Woman. I can't tell you how many people get so, it's like, oh, my underoos. <laughs> they love it. These little sandals? I had these when I was little. Did you have this one? Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I don't know if I can catch it for you. I had these. Oh my the god. The hologram. And they're like in perfect condition. Well, they still have the store tag. Yeah. On, but this was what was so cool. Yep. Here she's punching a shark. Yeah. Yep. She's beating the crap out of a shark. I love it. I totally it. had these when I was little. Oh my god. That's this just took awesome. me back like big time. That is really awesome. You were a very lucky child. I was. <laughs> so let's talk a little bit again about how this started. This all started from your grandmother had stuff and then your dad found eBay. There was a little bit from Graham, <laughs> yeah. but dad found eBay. And again, he was thoroughly random in his hunts and never did, you know, never got to know like what was there and what wasn't. It was just that it was so cool because it was Wonder Woman. Yeah. But even though he was random, he turned up some really good flukes. One of them is you see this mug? This is something yeah. that you'd go, like, a pottery class or whatever, yeah. and you'd make the mug, all right? If you look behind it, two totally separate purchases. This is the mold for the slightly smaller mug. But again, just by fluke, he got the mug, he got the mold. And this is my favorite. Oh, my God. All I know is whoever Uncle Norbert is was really, really happy on his birthday. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Like the Wonder Woman sheets? Yeah. Now, see, now you're getting into the kids' room area. Yeah. Okay? So, the bed here, which I have overly jammed with everything, it does have, a, it's like, this is a great Wonder Woman on here. And yes, there are Wonder Woman sheets on underneath, but That's awesome. you can't see them. Pillows, games. This is like, this was like my dream room right here. Yeah. <laughs> and since we didn't have a window, this, it's the almost clock. the same as the clock. But anyhow, so we, we made it so that we could have our curtains up here. And the curtains are really cool. There's pillows, there's, it doesn't stop. This is, I kind of just want to stay here and play with it right now. <laughs> um, especially with Tim, Temper Tantrum Batman. Yes. That's the best. He, he's not happy because First she's driving his car, then he's got the helmet, so he seems to be having a tantrum. So she took all his stuff. So this is this is this closed. Yeah, and okay. this is the box that, like, here's your your box on it, and here's the whole thing. It took 
it had to have been four tries before I could finally get one that was complete with the ramp. The ramp was always missing. So I finally found one. This is so, so awesome. So it's together. All right, so let's talk about the Linda Carter corner. She came here. These are the pictures from when she came. She did come here. Okay. She came, she came to visit after we had met her when she was touring and she was at Mohegan Sun. This was when Linda Carter came to visit. This is what her wall looked like. But after meeting her and after realizing it's like, she wasn't just 40 years ago, you know, somebody who played Wonder Woman. She's a singer. She's always been a singer and she's damn good at it. So thank you. Thank you a thousand times over. This was probably one of the best days of my life. So thank you for sharing this collection with me, for letting us into your home and for talking about some of these amazing pieces. I feel like um, you're never gonna get rid of me now. That's okay because <laughs> I totally will keep you. You can stay, Yay! you can stay. And it's Wonder like, Woman's and my family now. thank you for your enthusiasm. Aww. Wonder Woman is here because of all the fans that love her. So thank you. Thanks guys and I hope you enjoyed this amazing tour.